Hi there. In this video, I'm going to share with you how to write a C++ program that able to convert seconds into hours, minutes, and seconds format. Okay? For example, let's say an user input 5000 seconds. So your program should be able to convert this value into let's say hours followed by minutes followed by seconds all right this is what actually your program is going to do so now let's see how this conversion conversion can be done so this is one of the way that can we can and that we can do this so let's go now the first thing we must do is ask the user input so let's say see all right we prompt the user to input so let's say please enter seconds all right okay now we need to store the user input into a variable let's say seconds all right so now you see this straight line it means we did not define our what types of uh, of data is actually seconds going to be so we define integer seconds all right okay now let's design how our output going to look like so see out all right here though okay let's for now let's use hours for our hours value and then so this is for our hours All right and then followed by minutes followed by seconds all right so it's going to display hours minutes and seconds all right okay now let's define minutes and hours So now let's work out how this conversion going to happen. So let's say when the user input 5000 seconds. So how we are going to convert it first into minutes and seconds. So the minutes is going to be equal to let's say 5000 divided by 60. All right so this way because one minute is 60 seconds so so you're going to get okay i hope you can do this calculation by yourself 53 because we don't want to use the remainder the remainder is going to be the seconds all right how to find the remainder so it and then we use this modular 60 so you are able to get 20 as the remainder Alright, so we repeat the same process again for hours. So let's go this. So the minutes is equals to the seconds from the user in input divided by 60. Alright. And then the seconds means the remaining seconds will be 
hence remainder of 60. Alright, so this we are able to find when a user input second, how many minutes are they and how many seconds are they. But the thing is, we have to do the same process for hours. So hours is actually equals to minutes, right, divided by 60. And then the new remaining minutes will be minutes remainder of 60 also because 1 hour is 60 minute. So these 4 lines is actually going to do the conver conversion for you. I hope you can try this in your own uh, laptop or machine and run this and try to see how the output going to be. Thank you very much.